here we go. We are right back at it. We are here at the Desert Coaster Park. There's some coasters that we got to roll around in. Because our goal is to get through this door, but it's locked. We're going to eventually end up up there on that building. Very certain of that. And uh, we got some baddies over here. Let's see how well this goes for us. It didn't go too well last time. That's not well. It's hard to fight two things at one time because they're jerks. Way too close to an uh, ledge, I don't like that. You gotta get real lucky. Or you just have to actually know what you're doing. Alright, I got a tail. Cook that up later. Maybe have some dinner. Alright, so here in this build. Whoa, hey! running into you guys all over the place. What are you doing? Gore Tram. This station here was used by folks heading into the old mines. People still ride the mine carts all over the place, though. I am probably supposed to tell you there is some safety information about using the carts posted on the wall over there. Cart riding can be, uh, dangerous at times, so I would suggest you give that stuff a quick read. Thanks, man. Put on some pants. Approach the cart and press A to get in. Lean your body to balance the weight of the cart as you approach a curve. Well, I'm gonna crash, I know that. If you're moving too fast, press B to slow down and jump to clear obstacles. All right, who's ready to learn things the hard way? Slow down. Oh! Almost went over there. That would have been bad. Whoa! <laughs> Gotta lean and hold B on these turns because otherwise I'm gonna go flying. These are very unsafe. Why would people use these? Oh, gosh. There we go. We got it. We got it. We got it. It never said how to jump, did it? All right. All right. We're still going to want to slow down. This one, no. The secret here is that you're just always going too fast, so you always need to hold B to slow down. Alright, first track cleared. I did not see those bugs and I missed my chance to catch them. Oh, I thought you were a bug, but you're not. You're a bunch of gross things. Another mine cart over there. What were you doing up there? And this is our zip line back down to the bottom, but we definitely don't want that right now. So we're gonna we're gonna keep going. Oh, hey, there's a little robot right here. What's this say? to the construction bay. That's where we want to go. Yeah, it doesn't really 
actually say how to jump. Circle? Why is it a circle? Oh, if maybe do I lean this way? Maybe I'm supposed to lean to the right to catch that other track. We're gonna try it. We're gonna try it. We're gonna try it. We're gonna try it. There we go. These look like obstacles to me. Oh, lean, lean, lean. Yeah, alright. There we go. That would have ended badly, I'm sure, if I had decided to go straight through that X. Alright, so here, here's a jump. How do I jump? Alright, so we're going to try that again. Faster, we we definitely made it f farther. So B slowed down and R. This one tell me about R. Better? Better? Yeah! Ooh! <laughs> Whoa! No, 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 no! Oh. Alright! We did a lot better that time. Let's keep going. We just didn't catch that turn like we were supposed to. just to make it one building over. All right, and here we have barrels full of money. Love it when barrels are full of money. It never happens in real life. And since we made it this far, we're going to save our game. Because you should save your game every chance you get. Alright, 
this building is uh, the shipyard construction bay, as told to us by the annoying blue person. All right, we got some dangerous spiders. With the passing of many years, this structure has filled with sand. I recommend looking in the sand for a clue that might direct you to the location of the ship. Alright. We're gonna go looking for clues. Can we climb up there? Nope, sure can't. Alright. Disgusting. You could at least have some kind of carapace instead of looking like you're nude. Don't like it. We're gonna get out our leaf blower here. No, I don't wanna fight you. The good news is we know how to do this, because we've done it before. The bad news is we still got to do this. Let's see the boss in the first movie that Sometimes do I have to poke you in the eye before you give up? Lime green goes well. You could have made a really cool 
purple and lime green scorpion. But instead, you had to be a cop. Monsters have moved in and built a nest. Good job, Fi. I estimate the chance of finding a clue in the sand here to be as to the ship's location is extremely low. You're the one that told me to be here. I like that the uh, operators of the construction bay, they like to put the little robot employee of the months on the doors. Good job, Robot Jim. Your employee of the month for March. Here's your door. Oh, is that it? Is that the end? I almost don't believe that. Let's check back in with our robot pirate. Pirate Pete. The ship wasn't there, then there is only one place left for us to look for clues. This can be scary, but we have to head to the stronghold of the pirates who stole my ship. So let's not waste any time. Alright. Let's hit it. This is pretty scary. The pirate captain is a mechanical maniac. He's got no shortage of evil underlings, too. I never wanted to lay eyes on him again, but if we want to take the ship back, we have no choice. The pirate stronghold is here at the X. It's right there. Well, I mean, if that's the case, then I'm going to go see what's over here at this island first, since we haven't visited that. Oh, I need to take these other beacons off here. That way I don't get all confused on the trip. Don't hit the rocks, don't hit the rocks. Don't hit the frogs. No! That's a lot of rocks. Came right out of nowhere. They really make it hard to navigate sometimes. Like they really don't want you going back and forth. What do you do with a Lincoln sailor? What do you do with a Lincoln sailor? What do you do the Lincoln Sailor, he is also a robot. That's kind of cool down there. I would have thought that, that would have been a place to swim to. That's not right. Well, it is where I was aiming. It's just not where I wanted to aim. Alright, what's this? Can I dock? I can't dock. Do I have to be facing the other way to dock? Nope. Alright, so that must be important. Which is why we will save it for later, and in the meantime, we're going to head straight back to where we should have just gone in the first place. Because I hit the button to shoot, and then I immediately turn so I don't crash. Ah! What are you? Ah, oh, he's hitting the boat. I don't know what that was, but it was ugly. That thing was all forehead. When it rains, nothing gets in his eyes. He's got that forehead. Oh, so many frogs. Eat 
evil pirate cove. And you just tell. Look at those evil pirate pylons. Pirate stronghold. Oh, well, we got a box up there, it looks like. Is that stronghold just a giant maw? This is easily as scary as I thought it would be. But if you think about it, they should all be dead. The only reason I'm up and about like this is because of that time shift stone on the boat. So I have nothing to worry about. I feel better now. And it's time for you to go look for my ship. I'll wait here, of course. He mentions the time shift stone because we're going to run into some time shift stones and then all of a sudden I'm going to be surrounded by pirate baddies. We have wisely saved our game. Oh. Oh no, you are twice as big as I would want you to be. So much shocking is happening. I don't like it. All right, that only took forever. Hey, I found a door. I don't know if I want to go through that door right now. Hold on, hold on. We're gonna look around a bit. Through that here, we've got bats. I'd rather deal with bats than deal with evil little shot goo. Oh, oh gosh, oh gosh. Okay, that's sand. That is sand. Get the heart, get out of the sand. Yeah. Yeah. I tell you what, electricity gets old real fast. Can I have like a wooden sword? I'm gonna come over here, I'm gonna break these barrels into their parts. I have one heart. No! It is now lost to the dunes forever. Crap. Anyway. Got some bugs. Come here, bug. Ah, this net is small and pointless. I can't wait until I get a bigger net. So it does, in fact, look like the door I need to go through is, in fact, over here. In fact, in fact, in fact. That's the employee of the month for November. His name is Stu. Alright, what do we got? We got a room. Those things on the wall are gonna come into play later. Hi fi. Please take a look. This device looks like it is meant to hold a time shift stone, but there is not one currently installed. There is a 95% chance that it is the same type of device as the ones that we encountered in Lanayru Mine. Signs indicate that time shift stones were used in this facility as a kind of power source. I guess we'll just take that information and run with it. Also, I'm getting really sick of Phi throwing out percentages at me. There's a 90% chance that this is the right direction. Phi, it is the only direction to go in. There's a 60% chance that everything I'm saying is completely irrelevant. Well, no, it's not irrelevant, so you're wrong there. It's just redundant. Stupid. And I hate this right now. 
I want to lose so much. Wait, let's see. Is there... Okay, I can't grab on to him with that. I'm just going to let him stand there and wait for me. Can I, like, can I whip him? No. That's a... Oof. Darn. Yeah, alright. Got lucky on that one. How about you? Ooh. I don't like being on fire. I also don't like uppercuts. Okay, I got another tail and I got some hearts. That wasn't entirely terrible. That was only kind of terrible. Yeah, there we go. There we go. All right, we got a we got a toad. All toads are good for blowing up. Get that heart. Get that heart get out of the sand. Good job, Link. Employee of the month for April, right there. April 2017. His name is. Nobody remembers his name. He was kind of a jerk. He only worked here for like a month. Two months tops. Stole the show. Everybody hated him. What? Fi? Yes, it's a, it's a box. A time shift orb. I conjecture that unlike the time shift stones we've seen, this device was designed to be carried around and installed in different locations. How handy for me. Or do I just have to like walk back? direction. What happens if I try to go this way? Oh, I told you those would come into play. Now those lasers won't let me by. So I've got to walk through the invisible razor wire now. Oh! Ah! I will totally call HR if I have to. Barrels that hold hearts, good deal. So those guys literally just died standing there so they could come back to life and harass me. Ah! Surprise guardian robots. Oh, I'm gonna wanna put this down and go through this door so I can get this chest. If I got too close, those lasers would stop me. What do we got? Rupees! I'm gonna buy so many candy bars with all those rupees. It's gonna be great. Alright, what's this rupee? Ooh. Structures are important. They are important. Man, it's a good thing I can carry and jump at the same time. This thing is way more athletic than I am in real life. 
that cage is still there. I wonder what's on the other side of the cage. Oh, lasers. Hold on. Do I gotta put this down right here? And then run over here. And then... Oh, I can't pick it up. Oh! There's a handle there. Now we can pick it up. Keep it going. Plant. Structure. Structure. Plant. If I put this down right here, is this soft sand or okay? Nope, that's very not okay sand. Yeah. I can get that close. Nope, I can get that close. So I can still get a chest. We just got rupees, so this is probably some kind of material. It's material, monster horn. Too easy. You suck, plant. Oh, more structure? Okay. But why? Oh, another plant. Hold on. You missed! All those times you missed. That one didn't even try. Whoa! Alright. Those guys were awfully close together, I bet they're roommates. You couldn't see it, but I was doing air quotes on roommates. Ah, more plants. Alright, we're almost to the end of this horrible puzzle. Let's see, so we got a plant over there, we got a toad over there. Oh, I can I can roll and throw this thing. I have legit never thought to do that. Wonder if that'll come into play. Here in a little bit. Assuming I want to, what is this for? What is this block? For? Oh, I thought I was just gonna have to like stand on this switch. I am definitely gonna want to push this block on the switch. You know, just for weight purposes. Just because my slender frame is much too light and athletic. No one likes you. Ah! <laughs> they just missed me completely. What idiots. Alright, what do we got? We got some barrels. We have a razor wire room. With a guardian sentry in it. Oh, we have a chest in here. Over here in this room. Uh-oh. Oh, thank goodness. It started with a cutscene and I was like, oh no. This is gonna be horrible. 
Alright, more monster horn. That I still don't know what to do with. Let's see if we can find some hearts. Nope, not in there. Nope, not in there. Is there anything up here on top of these boxes? No, nothing. Alright, we got one. I'm gonna call that a win. These are the bouncing things that I don't like. Alright, so that's that room. This room has two guardian robots. I'm pretty sure I know, know what I need to do. Activate one of these robots right here. And take him out nice and swift like. Oh, he shot me. No. Stab. Stab the eye. Stab. Stab the eye. Dude. Alright, well, I'm gonna... I'm just gonna take a moment. No, I'm not. I'm gonna get shot again. I'm gonna take... I'm gonna take a moment. Okay, so na now... Now you can poke. Just go do the pokey thing with the sword. Great Googamooga. Am I about to die? Pretty sure. Pretty sure. Okay, we're good. We're clear. It's great. It's fantastic. Good. Fine. Okay, alright. Put that right there. I'm gonna go back. Oh. Um. I can roll this, so does it need to be over there? I can't roll it through there, okay. Alright. Okay, alright, alright. Can I... If I stand here, I can roll it that way? That'll have to do, because I'm pretty sure, yeah, that opens up that doorway, and it also opens up this switch. Can you, can you, you gonna jump? Can you get that guy? Thank you. And with that open, uh, I can grab my magic ball. Oh, forgot about it. Ah. Dude. Well, I'm out of potions. But I'm not out of bombs. Nothing in there. Alright, we got a rupee in there. Nothing in there. I'm about to die. Stop popping away from me, you idiot. Just come back here and accept my fate. Heart, heart, thank you. My odds of survival just got a little bit better. Okay. 
I was very certain I was about to bite the dust on that one. Glad I was wrong. So let's put that right there. And it is going to open the front gate. This is a very elaborate hideout. Like what pirates would have been able to do that? Who did they hire to do that? Did I see the ship? Was that my ship or was it the pirate ship? Oh, and I got an open door. The power of the time shift orb appears to have caused a change in this structure. I recommend going outside to further assess the situation. Fine. That was the plan. I hope this is the way to outside. Was this the way to outside? It was the way to outside. Alright, so we got ship's masts and stuff under the bridge. I don't think it's the ship I'm looking for, though. Fi, what? Just every five seconds, Fi. There's a 60% probability that these masts and the sails are from the ship that protects Nehru's flank. Just 60? You can set your dousing ability to search for the ship that holds Nehru's flank. Okay. Oh, these are just the masts from the ship. There's no actual ship. The ship is that away. So we open up our map while facing that away. We can't really see where we're at, we just know we're facing east. Okay, great. Is there anything worthwhile in these barrels? I hope so. Alright, I got some ants. I'm already full on bombs. I guess we're just gonna go back and talk to Pirate Pete and tell him what we found. Which was masts. Your ship have masts? Yes, it does. That does sound like a ship. So my ship wasn't here either. You found a clue? You know the place? Some kind of thing called dousing? That's amazing. This time we'll definitely find my ship. Ready to set sail? Might as well. Anchors away! How are we going to search this whole huge sea? I have no choice but to ask you to do this for me, so get cracking. There is a high probability that the ship is currently hidden from our view, but if we attack it, then we might catch a glimpse. Alright, well it's to the east. Which I'm reasonably sure is right here, where we weren't allowed to go earlier. So we're going to go that way and just start blasting cannonballs. What do you do with the drunken sailor? What do you do with the drunken sailor? Why are there so many toads? I hate toads oh so much. I don't know why, I just thought, yeah, I can fit right by that barrel, and then I was immediately like, mm, no, I have no idea what kind of hitbox those things have. And I am not in any kind of heart health. Find out. It's 
it's like flying in the sky around Skyloft. It just feels like it never ends. Alright, here we go. So I'm pretty sure... Am I allowed to douse? I am allowed to douse. Okay, so it's actually not there. Oh. That way. actually moves around. Did you see it? That's my ship. We must pursue it and keep pounding it with the cannon. There we go. There we go. Yeah. That is so cool that it moves around while it's invisible. Does it make sense? Not entirely because everything is sand, but also it's a soft sand, so I guess it's plausible. I didn't see any sails, so I don't know if it's working by power of the wind or, if, or, or how it's moving. I feel like maybe I'm looking into the details a bit too much, but how cool is that? We're on a sand ship. Awesome. What are those? All right. All right. Cool. This is going to turn into a bad guy later. We got to get rid of that razor wire. This might be a hole or something. We got some barrels that do not contain hearts. We got a door, though. Let's just go through it. Oh, we got another barrel. Heart piece. Nope, no heart. Okay. Well, I am saving here because I'm so low on health. And I will likely die soon. Alright, so there's a door we need a key for. <gasps> Butterfly. I don't know what you're doing inside of a ship. Caught ya. You can't actually fly away because we're inside. We're inside. Come here. Come here. Oh, it can fly away. It can actually just fly away. Well, they were flying right here. Let's see if... Let's just see if there's a... There is not a gossip stone here on the ship. That's cool. Didn't need one, I just wanted to see. Oh, but we did have naked scorpion babies. That's awesome. We have an ominous hallway. This is a very decorative door. I'm sure something cool is behind it. Got some hearts out of some bats. Captain's cabin? Awful little toad thing. Damn. 
don't know if I can run that distance. Let's try it. Oh, it was close. Man, that was close. I did not like that. Can we get this thing turning? We can get it turning. What happens when that thing is up to speed? Is it up to speed? It's taking a long time to get up to speed. Speed, 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 speed. Alright. So that does nothing. For now. Will remember its existence for later. More naked scorpion babies. Alright. It's down here, cargo hold. Oh no, just my nightmare. Just my nightmare. Nothing to worry about. Good. Ah. Just trying to get as many monster goos and rupees out of this as possible. Monster goo comes in handy. Ah, get off, get off. Why are there so many of you here? How is this hallway a hangout place for things like you? Alright. Now that that nonsense is over, and we have higher health, saving our game. Okay, we got a guardian robot tower. What? Fi? Fi. Fi. Yes, Fi. Fi. I know. I know. I was gonna figure it out with or without you. This door must lead to an important room in the ship. Yeah, it's probably where Leiru's playing. Alright, over here we have... Oh, we got chests over there. Oh, so many chests. All right, that is act number one, finding a way to all of the sweet, sweet chests. Overkill. I do not think there was any reason for me to do that to the bat, but it happened anyway. Okay. becomes what do I do with this information it looks like we have a uh, like a classic north 
No, because none of them are south, so never mind. These three are west, east, north, and then this one's over here is north. Oh, 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 no, no. Oh, oh, hold, hold on. Oh, I'm putting it together. My, my brain's not working entirely properly. So, with the red on the left, I should hit the right. Okay. The red's not on the left. Do I need to make this spin? No, the whip's not going to do anything. Um, uh, I mean, I don't think the clock rods are going to be up to much help. Okay. Well, okay, so let's just call it the top of it. Let's call it the top, so bottom. Okay, bottom. All right. And then... Top, top, bottom, right. No, it's not what I want. Right, so. Top, bottom, right, this is bottom. So bottom, then top, then bottom, then right. So, bottom. No, no, Link, no, no, no. Bottom. Top. Bottom. Right. Problem solved. Look at that. We are so smart. And now we can go through a door. To be completely honest, I am so surprised that that worked the first time. got a small key. Sweet deal. So we're just gonna head back to the room where we need the small key. save our game you know just for safety's sake we're gonna save our game now that we have the small key Still gotta come back downstairs because of those chests. Where is the small key room? Run, 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 run. Link really likes to cut it close. I also didn't even see what's down here. I just completely bypassed this hallway. Just 20 rupees. That is it. 20 rupees is 20 rupees, and I will take it. But that is all that was down there. All right. Oh, are we up on deck now? Well, 
that's not good. No. What are you? Oh, man. You look stupid and dangerous. Bring it on. Still out of shield, I have no shield. But he is out of here. And we get a chest. Hi, yeah, are you gonna tell me to open that up? There's a 99% chance that that was the pirate described by the captain. I can't help but admire the tenacity it has displayed in staying alive and functional all these years. I'm so glad you interrupted my chest opening for that. What do we got? Is it a shield? Oh, sweet! You can now hit targets at a very long range. Arrows also do a lot more damage than Deku seeds. The All Might to their Deku. A report about the bow you just obtained. Your bow's elasticity can propel arrows through the air with great force. That's what a bow is. To confirm the controls associated with your bow, Ray, uh, by pressing and then hitting the arrow. Why do I need to the You can also shoot arrows to strike certain devices in order to activate them. Okay. I have confirmed that such a device exists on this deck. However, it will be difficult to target it from where, from here, so I recommend you return to the deck. It will be difficult to target it from here, because look, it's locked. I need to go find some hearts. Like, real bad. Oh, cool. I like 
like that the bow puts you into first person. Alright, so here we are. Back on deck. What did that do? Ooh, it raises a, uh, a time shift stone. And Fi is going to tell us about it. Yeah, it, it's a time shift stone, Fi. An impact means significant effect on the ship and blah 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 I'm gonna save myself the arrow and see if Beetle can take care of this one for me. Might be too far away though. Yeah, it's too far. I really like the air spiral that you get around the bow, the, the arrows too, it's really cool. There's the sails. Oh, what are you doing? Okay. The door behind me is now shut. Got some bad guys to distract over here. Barrels to break open for some arrows. I do have a limited supply. <laughs> oh, got a skull. Oh, he's just coming right at me. He was like, oh no, you're not gonna shoot me with an arrow. But that's okay, because he's still going down. Alright, so I finally got some ladders up. I can't go down there. Let's go up. Oh! calling for help just now, but it doesn't look like anybody has answered him. More arrows. Okay, so we need to get through this door, but it's chained shut, which means we need to get onto this boat, and then it looks like we gotta shoot that thing right there. Please don't miss. And we will be slowly lowered into the water. Once we're... Oh, not in the water, just down to this little door right here. Um, it's not opening, though, so I guess maybe we need to shoot this blue eye device again. brought us back up. Let's look around. Do we have any other eye devices to shoot? Oh, we got some bad guys up there. You know what? Target practice. That's one. That's two. And that's three. Oh! That ladder goes all the way up, so let's go for that ladder. Oh, 
Sorry. Oh, somebody is shooting at me right now. Okay. So this is not where I'm supposed to be. Oh. Oh. I want to take him out before he takes me out. And maybe I can hit that contraption from here. Every time I get down to its level, my gyro wants to go higher. Oh, it went up. It went up. So maybe... Oh, I see. Okay. I'm going to take care of these problem kids. Messing with me, Gyro. Alright, so now that we've done that, we're gonna make our way across here. We're gonna fire an arrow up there. All right, we're gonna get those handles down here then. We're gonna jump up, ride it up there. Okay. And we're gonna repeat. But before we repeat, I see you. Looks like another one of those contraptions we're going to have to put our uh, sword into. Skipper says, good job. Now the ship just looks just like it used to. That makes me so happy. Now I need you to go rescue my crew. Pretty sure they're being held in the brig inside the ship. Which is right there. It's so pretty dangerous here, so I'll just wait in the boat. You can do it. Thank you, Pirate Pete. You're an inspiration to us all. Grab that. Ride this sucker down. Okay. We've got one of those. Which we can't reach from here. Oh, we got a fairy! And the fairy has healed us. Can we reach it now? It's down there. What is this for? Oh. Is this... Oh, what's down there? Okay, we got some 
butterflies, and we got a chest. Oh, we got a piece of heart! We've completed it. That's our fourth one, so we get an extra heart. Also get are some butterflies. I really, really want a bigger net. All right. That was a good detour. Always explore, kids. Okay. So now... He said we need to go to the brig. I do think that there might be... Gotta be something down here. <laughs> Door won't open. There's a ladder there. Might be uh, this might be something that we look at later. Right now we need to go smash some barrels and get some more arrows because I'm down to two barrels. We got two over here. That's great. Perfect. He said that his crew was down in the brig. Gotta figure that one out. We're gonna figure it out along the way, because I can't seem to read a map for some reason. Oop. Drop my controller. Now that the ship is back to normal, we should have more cool stuff to see. Just not down this way. There's still nothing down that hall. Room full of bad guys, though. I don't have my shield. Oh. Alright, there's a chest over there. How do I reach the chest? Maybe I just completely bypassed this my first time around. Because I'm an idiot. Right, that one's locked. That one's locked. This, this fan is already going. Can't make it fast. Uh, this door looks 
looks like it's open now. Let's see what's inside. Okay, guys. Get away from me. Alright, so we got a block. We can push over onto this switch. Open those doors, there you go. Nice. Okay. So that's the one where the boat should be. This is the one with the ladder, so let's climb down the ladder. We hit the boat eyeball from up here. Backtrack to that at some point. Okay. All right. Dead in there. Get ladder down here. I don't know what to do. Not seeing any kind of switches. I do see this guy. Can I shoot him through the floor? I can shoot him through the floor. Oh, can, I, can I reach that switch with my whip? No, I can't. Okay. Time to go back. We definitely missed something then. Oh 
Oh man. I'm confused about what I need to do. That's where we were. This is where we were. This is the brig. Oh, hey guys, hey, hey, it's okay. You're human. So how did you get in here? You came with the captain to save us. I'm so happy, but we can't get out of here while that sparky thing blocks the exit. I know, I gotta turn that off. I almost forgot to mention it, but the engine room is right below this brig. Yeah, I just didn't know what to do there. There's a corridor from the engine room that connects to this brig, but to get through the engine room to here, you need to activate the two power generators in the engine room. You will need to activate the power generators in two different locations. There and there. You can do it. Okay, thanks, bud. Yes, we need to go back to that area. This is the right level. So, out this door. And to our right. 
So it's this room. I think, hold on. Oh, it's not this room. So we gotta go out this door now. And the generator should be right in front of us. Does the ceiling have anything to do with it? No, the ceiling is just the ceiling. Well, that does nothing. Okay, I am stumped. I have no idea. And since I'm stumped, what I'm going to do is I'm going to think good and hard on this problem, and then I'm going to come back to it later. I'm going to come back to this problem later. That's what we're going to do. I hope you all will join me later for the solving of this problem. <laughs>